I, Michael, take you all then to be my wife. I promise. But for God and our friends and family to be a loving and faithful husband, to share with you in plenty and in want, in joy and in sorrow, in sickness and in health. And I will join with you so that together we may serve God and others. As long as we both shall live, God be my help. I, Alden, take you, Michael, to be your loving and faithful wife to share with you in plenty and in want, in joy and in sorrow, in sickness and in health, and I will join with you so that together you may say, serve God and others <laughs> as long as we both shall live. that the man should leave his parents and unite with his wife and it's commanded that husbands and wives that you love each other throughout your lives and that you give each other strength compassionate understanding and together share your joys and your pains marriage will also offer to the both of you the privilege and the responsibility of family and parenthood and will enjoin you that you support each other with all affection and concern that your family your friends and those celebrating with you today We'll see in your marriage a special love which comes from God and offers hope to all. Will you have this woman to be your wedded wife to live together in the holy estate of marriage? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health and forsaking all others, keep you only to her? so long as you both shall live. I will. Will you have this man to be your wedded husband, to live together in the holiest state of marriage? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health? and forsaking all others, keep you only to him so long as you both should live? I will. So we met through uh, a mutual friend of ours. Uh, we've always went to the same high school and on the same street, but we didn't know each other then. And um, we met through a friend. She's come to one of our parties, and uh, yeah, we met and uh, 
a couple times in passing, but uh, one day I just was like, hey, you should have my number, and I ended up taking her out. And the rest is history. No doubts in my heart that I found the one that's heaven sent. And today is your day. You look beautiful in that dress, baby. Yeah. I fell for an angel. Only two words for me to say. I'ma say it to your face. I do. I do. I'ma say it to your face. I do. I'm going to say it to your face. Mikey is someone that we as a family unit can rely on. He's someone that I can not only trust with my sister's feelings, but someone that I can also trust with my feelings and my mom's feelings, you know? Someone who sees my sister. There are moments where we might not have it all, well, she might not have it all figured out, and she needs some help. But he is her peace. He is her solution. He is her relief when she's still anxious or when she feels like things are getting heavy. Altogether, I am proud of you both. And I am so excited for y'all lives as couples, as lovers, as friends, as parents, as co-defendants. I'm not saying they're getting locked up in jail, y'all, but I'm saying if a crime was to go down, y'all would have each other. You feel me? It's a love that runs deep and I'm so excited to be able to witness you both go into this next chapter of life so sure. Walking back down the aisle here wondering where did time go? Where'd it go? We took the thought of a house and a wine picket fence and made it a home. This is your home, baby. Dear friends and family, Alden and Michael, they've come to offer themselves to God and to each other in the holy bonds of marriage. Marriage is established for our welfare and our enjoyment, and marriage makes sacred the union between the man and the woman, and offers to them both the opportunity to grow together in more complete manhood and womanhood. So as both of you have chosen each other, you've chosen these friends and family to celebrate with you, and of course you've chosen one of the most beautiful places on earth to be made one. It is my prayer of blessings upon you from this point onwards. We made it this far. And now we're standing hand in hand No doubts in my heart That I found the one that's heaven sent And today is your day You look beautiful in that dress, baby Yeah. I give you these rings As a token Of the vows we just made and as a pledge of my love for you. And with these rings, I now take you all then to be my wife. Wallahi. Slide it on her finger. Now take your time. Take your time. Don't no rush. I do. I'm going to say it to your face. I give you this ring as a token of the vows we just made. And as a pledge of my love for you. And with this ring, I now take you, Michael, to be my husband. And who gives this woman to be married to this man? Thank you so much. Give her a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. I fell for an angel. Only two words for me to say. I'ma say it to your face. I do. Now, since Alden and Michael have consented together in wedlock, they've witnessed the same before God in this company. You've pledged your love one to the other and have done so by the exchange of vows and rings. I, Damian Austin, marriage officer in the island of Jamaica, it takes it a great pleasure to pronounce them officially as husband and wife. So make some noise for them, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, make some noise for them. You can do better than that. Now, the moment that you've all been waiting for as has arrived. I hear Mikey up here going, mm-hmm. 
Yep. Yeah. Yep. And so if you were paying attention to Michael like I was, you'd realize he's been licking his lips ever since Alden started walking up this altar, anxiously awaiting this moment. Also hear that young people kiss very aggressively, so I'm taking myself out of this way. I'm coming down here. I want to say, sir, you may kiss your wife. bride Alden since the eighth grade when I first met Alden I heard her before I saw her in coach Gill's health class doing the same thing she does now like literally right now <laughs> laughing loud as hell and cackling jokes what I grew to love and learn about Alden was that she wasn't just a cheerleader for me but everyone around her and with no motive or expectations, that's just who she is. You felt it around her sister, her mom. She's just good people. I've known this dude for most of my life. Uh, we've had the pleasure of a. Uh, terrorizing many people together. Some of them are here today. Uh, I've also had the pleasure of uh, seeing Mike grow as a person and then into a father and now a husband. Those last two things would not be possible without Alden. Can we have a hand for Alden? <laughs> Mike's always been a good guy, but he's undoubtedly better because of you and uh, watching you two bring a life into the world and build one for yourselves has been a joy and a personal inspiration uh, from graduations both of you to home ownership and now marriage I'm not sure what you both have in store but I'm gonna speak for everyone here and say that we can't wait to see it and we're all rooting for you Be full of my command, 
like zombie Go down on me, yo, oh, we drop coca body Follow my command, D like zombie Go down on me, yo, oh, we drop coca body You have been nothing but respectful to my child You have loved her You've been there for her through ups and downs You guys have been two peas in a pod I am so happy for you I can't thank you enough for giving me my Avery, because she's the love of my life. I love my girl, but I love my grandbaby, okay? Amen. And I am so happy for you guys. Y'all can accomplish anything if you put your minds together. I am so proud of the two of you. And this day couldn't be blessed and more union than for the two of you guys. So I pray that moving forward, God gives you all the strength to stay with each other Continue to be friends, not only husband and wife, but being friends got you to this step. And I pray that you guys continue to be best of friends. And I am here whenever you need me. I love you. I always will. Cause this your miliki for fronting now for me. Hold on for me. I no go to me corny. And if your miliki na fighty, I saw me to look. Baby, gonna, gonna Waka, waka, when you enter my little Baby, gonna, gonna Do you give me sugar? Wala, wala Macho Mona Lisa 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 today is a huge day i thank you all for being here i am so proud of Odin and mikey and so proud of my sister for being here for doing this for actually for actually putting two girls through university as a single parent. But forget, forget, forget about being a single parent in just university. But these damn girls became, got the masters. I mean, who does that on a single parent salary? My sister did. And every day I praise God for them. And Mikey, we are giving you our diamond. We are asking you to hold it so carefully. Seriously, hold them carefully and love them and take care of them. Girl, I'll be foolish if I don't let you indulge me. Your lips like poison. I'll take my chance with you. Alden is funny. She's resourceful. She's smart. And um, she's somebody who doesn't know her own, her, her own potential because she has a lot to offer, a lot to give. I just want her to be happy. Like I want, you know, like just want her to this to be a dream day for her. It's like I'll be happy. We could have did this at McDonald's or American Deli, but you know, this is I want this to be a perfect day for her. <laughs>